everybody, Hoodie Cobra Commander 788 here, and this is a quick shot of the 1985 Bridge Layer Toss and Cross and the Driver Toll Booth. This is not the full review. I will do a full review on these in the future, uh, but this is, I wanted to give you just a quick look at them. Uh, I have to thank Troy Smith for helping me uh, get this vehicle and figure. This is one that I've been looking for for quite a while, but it's actually difficult to find one that's intact, uh, so thank you very much, Troy, for hooking me up with this. The Bridge Layer and Toll booths are often counted with the 1985 G.I. Joe releases, but they were actually available briefly in 1984. Uh, but we'll talk about that when we do the full review. The action figure that came with the vehicle toll booth is kind of a construction worker looking guy with a hard hat, and he came with a uh, sledgehammer. Um, and this is a deceptively simple figure. I mean, it looks simple, but it actually has a lot of very interesting little bits on it, uh, and it has a lot going on with it, so we will uh, talk about all of that in the full review. The bridge layer itself uh, has a feature that gives it uh, its name. It has a bridge um, that folds up and it can uh, be stowed on the top of the vehicle like that. Now, I'm not going to demonstrate how to do this right now uh, because um, I'd have to place it on this extender bar uh, and that's a bit of a problem. This is actually why it's so hard to find one of these complete. Uh, uh, this bar here is uh, really not engineered very well at all. Uh, it has, uh, it puts a lot of pressure on these bars right here and those can just snap off. It's, it's very hard to find one that is is not broken. So uh, I'm just not going to risk that right now. Uh, Troy was very nice uh, to help me get this vehicle, um, and so I don't want to break it before I even have a chance to review it in full. Uh, but it does have a lot of other really interesting details on it. Some of the details on this vehicle are borrowed from other G.I. Joe vehicles. Um, it also has a couple cannons. They both swing uh, around like that, uh, pivoting cannons. Uh, and it has some fake treads that rolls on some wheels there at the bottom. Uh, now, uh, this is a pretty cool vehicle. Uh, it's been requested a lot, and I'm looking forward to doing a full review on it. Uh, but I just wanted to give you a quick look at it for now. Uh, I do like uh, displaying the bridge layer on its own bridge, um, and I like uh, toll booth uh, standing with it. Uh, so there you go. That's a brief look at the 1985, or you might say 1984, bridge layer and toll booth. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, check back on Sunday for another full vintage G.I. Joe toy review. Thanks everyone for watching. I'll see you next time.